Hello, uh, I am Anesh Joshi with my other two, two uh, teammates, Avdut Rajurkar and uh, Dignesh Theshia were given a topic where we had to design an agricultural machine required for plowing, sowing and weeding. So let's start with the design. We will go for the basics of agriculture as we are uh, say we all know that these are the three basics for farming. Uh, we start with plowing where the process it's the process where we break up the soil so that the top so the bottom soil can come up and the top soil can go down and the fertility of the soil can be improved. The second process is sowing where we saw seeds inside the soil and third is weeding where we remove the unwanted plants from the soil which are not required or which would hinder the process of farming or uh, say process of uh, getting more crop. Uh, we started with the basics that what should be the design as tractors are available in the market and there are farmers who are actually using animals to uh, say cultivate crops. So we started from the basics that what are the problems, why some farmers are still not purchasing the tractors even though the tractors, small tractors are coming in the price range of 2 lakh rupees. Then we started realizing that the cost is the major concern. Then we concentrated basically on the cost that how we can cut down the cost of the machine and how we can club the operations in a single device so that uh, uh, an illiterate farmer can also operate the machine very easily for a sufficient period of time. This is the design which we actually made. This is simple design where we have a frame and this is a simple rear wheel driven vehicle where we have a 150 cc engine running rear two wheels using a chain and sprocket drive. Uh, we tried to accommodate all the three mechanism in the same device. We have a plowing mechanism in between the vehicle so that the CG of the vehicle might help uh, the vehicle to penetrate or the plot to move, penetrate more inside the soil. Then we have a seeding mechanism just after the plowing mechanism through which the seeds can flow to the uh, to the plot soil. And at last we have a weeding mechanism through which we would be able to cut down the plants which would hinder the process. Uh, we worked on the uh, mechanism for quite a few time and then finally we designed uh, the component in the software and finally we could get out a print using a 3D printed uh, technology. This is the actual model where I can show you parts. This is a uh, rear wheel. This is the engine with the help of a shaft and chain and sprocket there we can run the vehicle. This is the seat on which the farmer would sit and drive the vehicle. A bucket where we'll be putting our seeds and these are the pipes through which the seeds would go into the soil. This is a simple plowing mechanism. Uh, uh, I would say the unique selling point of this design is we tried to cut the cost not more than 60,000 per piece initial cost and we try to keep the design so simple so that uh, even an illiterate farmer can operate the machine without any hindrance or without any specific training. Um, the other thing which we thought about that even if a farmer is able to purchase a machine what is the cost of service for the machine for which the fa farmer is purchasing the machine as this is a very simple design even a farmer with, with some training can service the machine for some time. So with this I would conclude my presentation and I would invite the next group to come in.